Living and learning at Impala has shaped me in ways that I never expected. I'm definitely at my happiest when I'm outside in nature. Feeling like I'm really part of the ecosystem where I'm living in is something I've come to really deeply value. My name is Zoe Sims. I'm a Princeton in Africa fellow here at Impala Research Center in Kenya, and I'm a Princeton alumna class of 2017. Princeton in Africa is really about providing leadership and professional development opportunities. My role as part of the management team at Impala involves connecting and supporting um, the students with the management and also supporting our researchers here at Impala and supporting some of our outreach programs, including the Northern Kenyan Conservation Clubs program. Zoe came from the Ecology and Evolutionary Biology Department at Princeton, so I knew her when she was a senior. She came here, immersed herself, got to know all the faculty members, got to know the staff, and I've watched her grow and mature, and she's now very confident in her role. We had a group come from Old Gear Gear, one of our schools, one of our conservation clubs. Where they live, they do not see zebras, they do not see dick dicks, they do not see hard beasts, they do not see elephants. And so when they come to Impala, it's amazing for them. So it felt to Zoe to blend right into their school, to blend in and work with their teachers and make it an amazing experience for them. And when we heard them over lunch talking about, I saw this and I saw that and I saw this, it's clear that she has done a terrific job. As human beings, we are part of our ecosystems everywhere we are. I find that being here at Impala in Kenya, I'm more acutely aware of that fact. Partly because I wake up every morning to the sound of guinea fowl in the bushes outside my room. And many days I go to sleep at night to the sound of hyenas in the distance calling to each other. All of these things are just these reminders that I am part of nature. I've never gone to a new place before and felt so quickly at home and so welcomed with such open arms.